Hi friends! My name is Aubrey. My pronouns are she, her, and hers, and I am really excited to get to read you one of my favorite books. It's called Red by Michael Hall. Let's get started. I can't wait to learn about this crayon. He was red. But he wasn't very good at it. Oh dear. <laughs> His teachers thought he needed to practice, says teacher. Teacher thought he needed to practice. I'll draw a strawberry and then you draw a red strawberry. You can do it, really. But he really couldn't. Are those all of his teacher's red strawberries and all of his blue strawberries? Like this, said the crayon. Oh my, said his teacher. Let's try again. His mother thought he needed to mix with other colors. Why don't you go out and draw a nice big orange? A really big one, said the yellow crayon. A really orange one said the red crayon. But they made green. They made a big greenish one instead. Oh, yuck. Oh, whoops, said the red crayon. His grandparents thought he wasn't warm enough. Are these his grandparents? Your class is making self-portraits for parents' night. Wear this nice red warm scarf. Nice. It's going to look so good on you. But it so wasn't him. See all the crayon self-portraits? And there's the red crayon. That doesn't look red to me, does it? Does it look red to you? I don't think so. Oh, dear. Everyone seemed to have something to say. Sometimes I wonder if he's really red at all. Don't be silly. It says red on his label. He came that way from the factory. Frankly, I don't think he's very bright. Well, I just think he's lazy, right? He's got to press harder. Really apply himself. Give him time, he'll catch on. Oh, of course he will. But he didn't catch on. Green frog, black sheep, brown cow, oops. Oh, ack. All the art supplies wanted to help. The masking tape thought, well, maybe he's just broken inside. This will help hold you together, put some tape on. The scissors thought that his label was too tight. One snip should do it. I thought he wasn't sharp enough. Stay still now. Is there a crayon sharpener trying to sharpen that red crayon? But even with all our help and all of his hard work, blue hearts, blue cherries, blue foxes, blue toes, he just couldn't get the hang of it. Is a crayon trying to draw a stoplight? Green, yellow, red? I don't know if that looks red to me. One day he went to meet a new friend. Will you make me a blue ocean for my boat? I can't, I'm red, said the crayon. But will you try? So he did. Thank you, it's perfect. You're welcome, that was so easy. Look at all that nice blue water the crayon drew. And he didn't stop there. Blue bells, blue bird, blue jeans, blue whale, blue berries. I'm blue, said the crayon. He was blue. And everyone was talking about it. My son is brilliant. Who would have known that he was blue? I always knew he was blue. It's so obvious. 
His blue ocean really lifted me up. All of his work makes me happy. His blue strawberries are my favorite. He's so intense. I'm going to make a green lizard with him, a really big one. I hear he's working on a huge new project. He's really reaching for the sky. And he really was. Oh, friends, isn't it so great when you just get to be yourself? When we get to be who God made us to be. Because God put a lot of work into us and a lot of thought and a lot of love so that we can be exactly who we are. Let's pray together. Repeat after me. Awesome God. Thank you for today. Thank you for the chance of making us who we are. Help us to love ourselves and love our friends and love our family. Thank you for being a big God who loves us so much. Amen. Have a good rest of your day and thanks for reading Red with me.